Hey guys, so I just wanted to share these awesome erasable pens with you guys. Um, I've been like totally out of the loop and I didn't even really know, like I'm, I remember kind of like years ago uh, there was just some really basic like blue and black erasable pens and then I, you know, didn't really look into them for years. And just recently I was like, you know, I would love to have erasable pens for my planner because I really hate having to cross stuff out. And so I just like Googled them and there's a million options now. There's like so many erasable pens now. It's really kind of exciting. And um, I found some well-rated ones on Amazon that were quite affordable. Um, I will link to them below so you guys can check them out. Um, but these are, there's there's some that are made by like some of the bigger name brands and this one's more sort of like an off brand, but um, the price was really good and the ratings were good. So I decided to give them a try and um, I have, they came in a bunch of different colors. Um, lots and lots of colors. So you can see, I don't even think this is all of them. I think some of them are like around the house somewhere, but I think it might have come with 15 or 20. Um, but I have a few here to show you guys. Um, and they just have, um, these just, you push on the little, um, this little piece and then they go in and out. They have a nice grip. And this is actually the eraser, believe it or not. It's, it feels real, like a hard piece of plastic, but it actually is what erases the pens. So, um, and I really love all of these different color options. They're just so, so many different colors. So you can kind of color code your planner or your diary or whatever you're uh, writing in there with. So um, maybe I'll just write hi here. And then I decide I don't want it to say that. So I just erase. And it's pretty easy to erase it. And then you can just start over and you can write something different on top. And um, the I think the, the only negatives I can really say about these um, are, one, I think they, they seem like they use up a little faster than regular pens. Um, I mean, I do write quite a bit with them, but I feel like they kind of run out of ink a little faster than what you are used to with regular pens. But since they are quite affordable, that honestly doesn't really bother me. Like I'm happy to just replace them and they do still last, you know, quite a decent amount of time. So it's not really like that big of a deal. And um, I just, I love that these are, have like this comfort grip. And I just so much like the fact that my planner doesn't look messy, just sort of like bugs me when <laughs> the stuff is like crossed out. Maybe you guys are the same, maybe you think I'm crazy, but I really love the fact that I can erase and keep everything looking nice and neat. And um, let me think if there's any other negatives. Oh, um, sometimes they don't write like as, like some gel pens, you know, are, it's like a really thick, heavy um, mark, but these are, it's, you know, like a little lighter. So I don't know if that bothers you. I also saw in some of the reviews, and this actually seems to be true for all erasable pens, not just these, but some people say that if you leave your um, book or whatever that you've written in with erasable pens, if you leave it in like a really hot car, like if you leave it in your car and it's like 90 degrees out or whatever, that the heat will actually cause the ink to fade. But then they say that if you just put your book then in the refrigerator or the freezer or something, then the ink comes back, which is so weird. It seems like a fun way to like make a secret message for someone. I don't know, maybe someone might have fun playing around with that, but that's another thing I wanted to point out just in case um, you guys leave it your, your um, something you've written on in a hot car and then you like panic because it looks like it's <laughs> it's fading or going away just put it somewhere cold and i think that's all i had to say about those so let me know if you have any questions or comments about these and i'll see you next time bye